If you've been following my channel for a little while, you'll know that I feel very strongly about emotional and social intelligence when it comes to engineers. I truly believe that emotional and social intelligence matter more than your technical skills as you raise up the ranks because you need to be able to be a better team lead than actually be down in the weeds technically every single day. I'm not trying to discourage you from caring about your technical skills or your IQ. I'm not saying that at all. What I'm trying to say here is that you need to care more about your emotional and social abilities than your technical abilities as you rise up the ranks. You need to become an incredibly well-rounded person because the emotional and social intelligence bar is typically incredibly low when it comes to engineers. Engineers and emotional and social intelligence normally are not in the same room, let alone the same sentence or in the same person. So if you can embody these skills and be incredibly sharp technically, you can become an absolute rock star. This is really the secret sauce to becoming a rock star when it comes to your engineering or technical job. Having the ability to have people skills is something that engineers ra rarely have. And this is something that you can go start to tangibly make some really great moves for yourself in not that much effort. Again, the bar is super low. Have you implemented any of the emotional or social intelligence tips that I've put across in this channel. You should let me know below how that's going for you because I know me personally, doing the things that I say in these videos has really helped my career as well as my mindset when it comes to work. So not only emotional intelligence, but social intelligence or SQ is of vital importance as you rise up the technical ranks because you need to be able to read a room cold. So you need to be able to read that room, understand who's in charge, understand the problems, really feel out the vibe and see if everybody's on the same page or not. And this is something that if you're, again, an engineer, these are muscles that you won't have developed. It's not that this muscle has atrophied, you just never would have had it. And it's something that, at least in my experience, isn't something that school tells you to ever look at. All the way through university, nobody really explicitly told me to care about social skills, my emotional intelligence, or really you know having some self-awareness and regulating my emotions more effectively. Nobody said any of this. And it's something that I have found so important that I have made this channel to talk about it with you. Because I think it's something that everyone should be caring about, not just technical people. I have the expertise of originally being an emotional robot and now becoming an incredibly social engineer who also has the technical chops. So I have the technical chops, but I can talk to people and I understand social situations a lot better than a majority of my peers. How did I get to this position? Well, it wasn't an accident. It took quite a bit of concerted effort over time, but the social intelligence aspect is something that you can start working on right now. So getting better at reading a room, so you need to have social awareness, so you need to be able to see the situation better. And then the second part of social intelligence is social facilities, and that's really what you do with that information. So the social awareness is really what I want to get across in this video, because you need to have the awareness that something's going on. So without awareness, you won't have any information to work on. So you need to have that awareness to start, and then you can start working on the social facilities and building your professional social network and having a higher output with your work as well as the work that you farm out to those around you. I trust you've been paying attention to this video thus far. I want to help you pay even better attention to your emotional and social intelligence by clicking the link below this video and scheduling a free call with me. On the call, we'll come up with a personalized plan for you to start getting bigger raises, faster promotions, and stronger relationships with everyone around you. Don't delay, click that link below and schedule a call with me today.